Hi, my name is Julie Leung. I'm in the microbiology class section 2965 of Fall 2021. Today, I'll be presenting my trigrophyton rubrum pathogen. The pathogen names and classification. Aside to the name of the pathogen is trigrophyton rubrum, the notable common names are athlete split fungus, jock edge, and ringworm. The pathogen is classified as belonging to the domain Eukarya, the genus Trigraphyton and a species to rubrum. Here we have a gram state image of trigraphyton rubrum under a light microscope. The pathogen culture requirements. Trigraphyton rubrum is an obligate arrow, therefore it strictly requires oxygen in order to culture. Most of the fungi grow at temperature ranging from 15 degrees Celsius to 35 degrees Celsius, with 32 degrees Celsius being the best temperature for optimal growth. A pH of 7 is best for optimal growth. Trigraphyton rubrum grows more when incubating in the presence of light. Here we have an image of trigraphyton rubrum surface and immersed culture of Sabarel, Dextrose agar media after 30 days at 32 degrees Celsius at a pH of 7. The pattern actual size of trigraphyton rubrum. Here we have an image of trigraphyton rubrum on a fingernail from a transmission electron microscope, and the size of organism is 8 micrometers to 50 micrometers. Pathogen life cycle. Trigraphyton rubrum reduced by the sexual life cycle. The cycle begins with the mycelium, which is the fungi in the vegetative form that consists of branch filaments called hyphae. Specialized hyphae called coniophores branch off from the mycelium and are able to reduce spores. The next step of the cycle, the coniophores release their spores called conidia. The conidia spores are haploid and will undergo the process of mitosis. When the Canadian forests have complete mitosis, they will remain dormant to wait for ideal environmental conditions. Once the environmental conditions are favorable, meaning a warm, moist air and skin, Canadian forests will generate to produce a new mycelium and the life cycle will start over again. The sexual reproduction of a eukaryote, such as trigraphite to rubrum, transfer an identical copy of their genetic material to their offspring through vertical gene transfer. Therefore, sexual reduction only produces genetic variation into the population of a random mutation in the pathogen's genetic material that is passed on to the offspring. Novel structures produced by the organism. Trickle phyto rubber produces and secrete metallocarboxypeptidase proteolytic enzyme in acidic conditions as important violence factors. These proteins enzymes have the ability to adjust the keratins in tissues, such as nail and strand carnium, into short peptidases and amino acids that facilitate the invasion into keratinized tissues by trigraphyton rubrum. Trigraphyton rubrum also produces secrete endoproteases, which break down peptide bonds and non terminal amino acids during host infections. Common names and diseases caused by the pathogen. The following are the common names and diseases caused by trigraphyton rubrum. Tinea pius, also known as athlete's foot. Tinea cruis, also known as jock edge. Tinea uguan, which is nail fungus, also known as oncomicosis. And tinea carpus, which is also known as ringworm. Where the pathogen causes these and major reservoirs. Trigraphyton rubrum frequently causes these worldwide through contact with infected skin scales or contact with fungi in communal, damp, and contaminated environments, for example, in the swing poles, public showers, and locker rooms. The major reservoirs to the river are humans and animals. Individuals most at risk. The individuals most at risk of infection for a trigger fight to river have the following a nail injury, skin that gets warm and sweaty for a long period of time, or skin injuries in moist areas of the body where the skin falls. Individuals most at risk for a serious disease from trigger fight to river have the following other age, what's the relation problems. Obesity and impaired immune system due to conditions such as diabetes or cancer. The mass transmission of sugar fights are removed more following direct hairless skin contact with contaminated warm, moist, and sweaty clothing, linen, and towels, or the risk in contact with affected skin scales or shed, or direct contact with fungi or yeast spores while walking barefoot on damp floors in public areas, or direct skin to skin contact with an infected person or an animal. A part of the venture of to room is the continuous inoculation of fungi into injured, broken human keratinized tissues such as skin, nails, and hair that are often warm, damp, and sweaty. 
The incubation period is four to 10 days, depending on where the trigger fight to root infection occurs on the body. The period of illness is the acute stage of infection, which lasts one to 10 days, and the contagious period of trigger fight to root root infection remains contagious for 48 hours. The signs and symptoms of trigger fight to root infections are the following. Dry, sunny skin, itchiness, flakiness, peeling and cracking the skin on the bottom of the foot, the groin, the thigh, the buttocks, arms, legs, and around the nails, and plain skin that might appear reddish, grayish, purplish, red scaly, elevated ring-shaped rashes in the brown arms and legs and buttocks, clear scaly area inside circular ring-shaped rashes with a scattering of bones, discoloration nails arranged from colors from yellow, green, and black, and thick brown nails that chip or break easily. The tissues affected by trigger effects and rumor are the following. The dust tissue caused around cardium that's found in the outer layer of the epidermis is made mostly of keratin lipids. The serious complications caused by trigger effects and rumor are the following. Fungal nail infections that cause the nail to be opaque, thick, whitish, and crumbly, and there may be inflammation and pain in the skin under the nail. Secondary bacterial infections that are painful, hot, and swollen. Cellulitis, which is a bacterial infection deep in the skin, which can affect fat and soft tissues. And untreated cellulitis can lead to bone infection or septicemia, which is blood poisoning. The diagnostic methods for trigger fight to remove infections are the following. Swabbing or scraping off a skin sample from the affected area to test for fungus by setting it under a microscope. Or sending the skin sample or scrape the skin to a laboratory for fungal culture or microscope examination of infected nail clippings and debris from under the infected portion of the nails. The primary measures for trigger effect to remove infections include falling, clipping nails short and keeping the nails clean, avoid walking barefoot by wearing sandals or flip-flops in the damp communal areas, keeping the skin in the growing area dry with a clean towel after shower exercising, taking clean clothes after exercising, and showering immediately after each practice session or match in close contact sports. Here we have the narrative of a case study of a trichophyton room of fungal infection continuum campus, which is ringworm to scalp. A 63-year-old female sought medical care for a skin lesion on the central parietal region of the scalp that had hair loss and scattered scaly brownish papules after having a skin lesion for five months. Histopathological findings show follicular inflammation that affected the lobules, fat septum, and the septal hyphae of the hair follicles. After culturing affected skin scalp scales on staparel dextrose agar, the results reveal white colored cotton like colonies that have red brown pigmentation on the reverse side of the agar. Trichophyton rumen was confirmed as the cause of agent as a result of negative urease results and the presence of multiple septate hyphae and micronidia. Microconidia. Under 30 days of systemic treatment, taking terminating 250 milligrams daily and using ketoconazole shampoo, the patient recovered from the trichophyton rumen fungal infection and had new hair growth. Here's my sources slides, and that concludes my presentation of a trigonophytum rubrum. Trigonophytum rubrum overall is important in microbiology because a majority of dermatophyte fungal infections are caused by trigonophytum rubrum, and that's why it's studied so extensively in microbiology. Thanks for watching the presentation. Thank you.